Hi, I'm Sophie Robson and I'm a straightness training mastery student from Scotland. Um, I thought I'd start with a tiny bit about myself first. I am a mother of two children, a two and a half year old and a nine month old. And part of my profession means that I train horses for equestrian theatre shows and stunt shows and I ride them and work with them within those shows. So that includes jousting, trick riding, horseback archery, liberty and theatrical performances. So I started straightness training in 2016 I think it was and the reason that I started was that I saw the mini mastery course and just thought oh this is right up my street. Um, I really love the five pillars of training um, mainly because I already did four of them a lot already um, so lunging was the only thing that I rarely ever did with my horses um, so it's been really interesting to learn about the lunging as well but really to delve deep into those other pillars has been really really interesting for me and really beneficial to the horses but also the other thing that I really liked about the course was that it didn't only look at horses on a physical level, it looks at the spiritual, the emotional, the mental level as well. Not only for the horse but for yourself, uh, which is a huge part of horse training and working with horses and I'd never really seen that before in a course so it really really did catch my, catch my attention. So the biggest things that I've gained so far from straightness training is I've just really been taking my time at going through it and really working on the spiritual, emotional and mental well-being for my horses as well as myself. Because I have two little children I hardly have time to exercise um, so the physical has sort of come in as a last resort. Um, but it's really interesting the the benefits that you can have from just doing a tiny amount of work with your horses. It, it's really extraordinary so I'll just quickly try to quickly explain. Um, my three main horses, I've got a little Portuguese horse called Poco. She was a rescue horse, absolutely terrified of people, still pretty nervous of people but she completely trusts me now and after doing quite a few years of the just the groundwork straightness training. I then really quickly needed to back her because she needed to do a show and it just pff, happened like that. She just fully trusted me because of all the work that we put in beforehand and within a year of me backing her she was performing in front of 7,000 people. One of my other horses that I work with, Merle, he's a lovely Andalusian. He struggles spiritually and emotionally a lot. <laughs> um, and being able to deal with those things, he now performs really nicely at Liberty and has been outperforming all over the place last year and we just have a great connection and next year I just know fine well he's going to excel and do some really good work. Um, and my other mare, Ria, who's another Andalusian, she just loves the groundwork and the work in hand so much. She just loves to feel the ability that she is strong, she's able to do the work. She would love to go everywhere and haunch is in now. She just thinks it's fantastic. And to see horses feeling empowered and uplifted by the work that you're doing with them, it just makes everything so much more fun to do. Oh yes, and the message that I would give to other people who are looking to come on to the mastery course is enjoy the journey. It's not a destination. The, it's your journey and your horse's journey or as many horses of you, as you've got and just enjoy that. It's so much fun. You don't need, you don't need to prove anything. Just enjoy yourselves. Mm -hmm.